Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome, welcome back to the game here. Welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2, the quest for the 100%. And we did some recovery missions, including the spines of America. America. And, what are we going to do today? Well, if you look at our menu map that we did check, well, there is a stranger right above us. And for 100%, we do have to do some stranger missions, so... Let's not be too strange with her, shall we? If we can get up there in time. I mean, there's no reason why we won't get up there in time. What up if I would have, uh... You know... Hit the horse. Hey, I got stamina points, which is good, because I need to do this, too. Wonder how ridiculous this stranger is. Oh, he's gonna top pet. He's gonna be a good one. Yeah, do you smoke, sir? Sure, but <laughs> perhaps not as much as you. Oh, we can't. No, no, don't worry about these. Actually, we'll take some. Take a couple of packs. Take a few. Oh, thank you. What are all the cigarettes for? Are you heading on a long journey or something? <laughs> no, 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 nothing like that at all. I'm just interested in the cards. Okay. The cigarette cards. Oh, you got any? Yeah? Well, get them out. Let me take a look. Come on, come on. A little picture card? Yeah, I'll pay you a good price. Okay. Here. Ah, nothing I haven't got. The value is in completing the set. Sometimes I'll smoke up to 200 cigarettes in one day, just so I can keep opening the packs. I wish I could explain to you the pleasure and the pain I get out of collecting these babies. Sure. Well, it sounds, uh... Thrilling? Yeah, it is. Not to mention the vast amounts of life-reaffirming cigarettes I get to smoke. Oh... And the amount of money? <laughs> a veritable fortune, sir. Fortune? Oh, sure, sure! A complete set of any series is worth a fortune. Yeah, look at this. Gunslingers. Over here? Circus freaks. Yes, yes, yes. Meow meows of the desert. So rare. I never knew. Sure. How much? Well, it depends on the rarity, sir. Oh, of course. Yeah. But, you know, if you ever get a complete set, I can uh, take it off your hands. You'd pay me. A fair price. Now you send them to me right here. Phineas T. Ramblebottom. At your service. Okay, I gotta run. This is my train. Look me up, okay? Think about this deal. Only a complete set. That's where the value lies. That was a lot of cigarettes. 201 day? So, that would mean we need to find, do that straight because we have to do another part of the 100%, which is, oh, I need to go to that. Way up there. Um. It's a camp. Dang, we're in the middle of nowhere. Oh, no. I want to rob the, the, the train. Uh, uh, oh, hi, Bobby. You okay, boy? Uh, uh, hey, boy. I want to pet the puppy. I want to pet the puppy. Pet the puppy, Arthur. I'm studying. Chesapeake Bay Retriever. Horse. He hitched. What else money that guy owns? Like has. There's no way reason for him to waste so much money on cars of all things. He is hitched. Are you freaking kidding me? Who hitches a horse? Oh, there you are. Alright. So, let's look at our map and figure out what our next objective should be. We are in the middle of... No Alright. That's the closest mission. 
Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Is go save some people in Blackwater. The last city in the first game, the first one of the first cities in this game. Yeah. Hopefully we can have a good time. Hopefully we can get a random account or two. That'd be nice, but guys, I will meet you there, and if we get an encounter, I will let you know as well. You know how I literally just say something, and I get killed immediately? Javier is going to be the hardest part of this whole mission. Oh, $17. Ouch. Why not? No, I'm still wanted. So, well, I want to do this time. Hey, I was up saying that. Oh, wait. Yeah. Look at the area. Hold on. I'm not going to listen to the game for a second. Weird for me. I want to yeah. go this way. If we just head straight there. Without taking any of the road, of course. We'll be in the best shape. I don't have a choice. Alright. 
So I wonder if I die again, would it get away rid of my bounty completely? I do need to... I'm gonna refill my dead eye. Well, thank you for telling me that game, that helps me out. to do the challenge, but, you know, game had other meanings for me. Oh! I didn't know I was right there on Javier. How many? A lot. Uniforms everywhere. You see Sean? No. I don't think so. Damn it. Where's Trelawney? Who knows? I... Just. <clears throat> Where is that little Irish pest? I'm not quite sure. Trelawney's off trying to find out. Has anyone been in the black water see how things lie? Place is crawling with Pinkertons, bounty hunters, and ah, pictures of Dutch and Hosea. Uh, well, we got a lot of money sitting in that town. And that's where it's gonna remain for now. You have a Honda? Why haven't they hanged Sean, I wonder? I think he's bait. Well, they wanna try them publicly. Uh, gentlemen, Sean is being moved up the upper Montana, then to a federal prison out west. Damn. Well, we can't be rescuing people from some federal prison. We either rescue him now or cut him loose. We're not cutting anyone loose. Of course not. Ike Scaldings, boys. I'm moving him to a camp nearby before handing him over to the government. So, I guess... We need to stop them before they get to camp. Charles, why don't you head up on the north side? And we'll head up on the other side of the valley and meet you. That way we have them in either direction. Javier, Josiah, come on. Let's go see. You know, Arthur, the government, or people whom the government like, seem to be very angry. Sure. Well, we'll rescue Sean and then we'll get ourselves lost, good and proper. It's a good country. I hope so. Okay, boy. Yeah, my traditional boy, but... Find the boat? Where the heck is the boat at? Oh, straight. Follow me. Where? Stupid markers throwing me off every Let's time. see if we can track down this boat. Keep your eyes open for Pinkertons. They got patrols out all over this area. Yeah. Definitely as bad as we feared in there, Arthur. I keep hearing about this woman, Heidi McCourt. Down there. The camera? Oh, no. I reckon those might be our boys. All right, gentlemen. Follow me. Follow keep your guns away until we know it's Sean, okay? I know what you two are like. You think they can see us? If they can, we're just three fellas out on the trail. Act natural. We'll be fine. So, you've been gone for a while. Much as I love dodging the law and sleeping in the dirt with you derelicts, I do have other business to attend to. What happened in New York? You know how life is. Never a straight road anywhere. Especially with you. Nice to know I'm missed, though. Have you run out of people to rob? Oh, we'll never run out of people to rob. 
but without me, you'll not find the caliber of victim that I find. Maybe. <laughs> anyway, we should keep it down. Come on, let's keep them in sight. You all right, Javier? You're quiet. He hasn't stopped talking since we left you in Valentine. It's the longest ride of my life. Cute, dear boy. Very cute. Hey! Pick up the pace a bit. Apparently, there's a camp somewhere around here where the bounty hunters meet and transfer before continuing out west. I imagine that's where they're headed. There's my horse. A good horse. Alright, so we're assaulting a boat on horseback? What is it? Nation of Pirates 1? Could be civilization as well. Not the point. Stopped. All right. Right. Let's take a closer look. Binoculars, gentlemen. So, who are these bounty hunters? I don't know too much about Holy Axe Geldens, boys, but I hear they're a big crew. And wild. Built some reputation in the last year or two. That looks like Sean to me. Certainly kicking up enough of a fuss. Yep. That's definitely Sean. Oh, they're giving him a decent kicking. Well, you can only imagine the shit he's been giving them. Oh, yes. They're taking him up the canyon. There's Charles on the other side. Let's go. What about the other two down there? I've got an idea. Follow me. Dog hammer can see Charles pretty easily. Alright, I wonder what his idea is. Wait, we're going down. Oh! Quietly, if we can. Leave it to me, gentlemen. I'll go around and create a distraction. Then you two sneak across and do the dirty on them. Okay. Get your knife ready. Keep your head down. Knife ready. Stay here. Let's get in the river. Wait until he's got them off guard before crossing. Way up the canyon to deal with. Okay, lean all those boots you got there, eh? Well, they're very nice. Who's the guy you got them from? Is he alive? Is it knife kill? Come on, focus. Oh. Focus, okay. Good 
You know, you're a lot less ugly from that other angle, Arthur. Come on. Do we get a hug, Arthur? A warm embrace for a lost brother now found. <laughs> You know, nothing means more to me than this gang. The bond we share, it's the most real thing to me. I would kill for it, I would happily die for it. But in spite of all of that, 
I would have easily left you here to rot if Charles hadn't stopped me. <laughs> I don't believe a word of that, Arthur. Get him out of here. You're a great man, Arthur Morgan. The kind of young whippersnapper can really admire. Oh, shut up. Right, we should split up. Javier, will you escort Mr. McGuire back to camp? Charles, best you ride separately. Be careful. There's patrols everywhere. What about you? I'm gonna see what's worth taking here. I'll meet you back there as soon as I can. All right. Hey, I'll be actually okay, come on. <laughs> Have I got stories for you? Yeah, I can't wait. <clears throat> I imagine y'all miss me a lot, but fear not. The joy is back in your lives now. Ooh. Yes. More. More weapons, which I definitely need. Ain't food. Okay. This is beef. A core is empty. Hopefully, I can get something here. Alright, y'all going on to get start. Platinum Pocket Watch? Gun oil probably would help. I need to find some good stuff, too, weapon wise. Here's some crap new satchels. Hmm. We don't really need ammo. Let's go ahead and call the horse. We need to get a town. That's a huge thing I need to do. But, guys, we save Sean next time on Red Dead Redemption 2. I have no idea. We'll figure that out next time.